Now that's Italian! Hello Alexi foodies! Today I'm going to teach you how to make big gnocchi featuring some fine ingredients from the Pastine Company. So stick around, it's coming up next. You are absolutely going to love this recipe. Gnocchi smothered in a cheesy roasted garlic tomato sauce. And here are the ingredients you're going to need to make this dish. We're going to start with the Pastine San Marzano DOP tomatoes, baby. Then we're going with the gnocchi, some fresh buffalo mozzarella, the double concentrated tomato paste, the extra virgin olive oil, the red chili flakes, the cracked black pepper, the sea salt, the garlic salt, the fresh basil, the pecorino romano, and some roasted garlic. We're gonna start by adding the roasted garlic right into your hot saute pan. You're gonna mash that all up, and we're gonna add in some red chili flakes. Why? Because I love things spicy. I am loving the new Pastine Double Concentrated Tomato Paste. You've got to get Add this. in a few tablespoons of that beautiful Double Concentrated Tomato Paste. Give it a good mix. Now you're ready to add in the San Marzano tomatoes. Add those right in and then start crushing them up. Season to taste with some garlic salt and some cracked black pepper. Now it's time to add in your fresh basil, the vasanagol. Give it a good stir and reduce to a simmer. Don't forget to salt your water. Why? Because mama always said, salt your water, make it taste like the sea. When the water reaches a rapid boil, you're gonna add in the gnocchi. Now keep in mind, these only take a couple of minutes. When they float to the top, they are done. Give your gnocchi a stir so they don't stick. And look how quickly they cook. Just a couple of minutes, as soon as they float to the top, they are done. Then get a large baking dish and start layering your sauce, your gnocchi, and some cheese. Wait till you see how unbelievable this turns out. Now we're gonna add in some Pecorino Romano, my favorite. Sprinkle on that cheese like the blizzard of 78. Now some beautiful, fresh buffalo mozzarella. We're building the dish. We're layering all of the ingredients. A little more sauce. A little more pecorino romano. And then we're gonna drizzle it with some extra virgin olive oil. Top with some basil. Wow. I'm gonna pop it into the oven until all of that cheese is ooey gooey and bubbly. I can't wait to dig in. While my gnocchi is cooking, I'm gonna have some wine. Cheers. It's done. Look how incredible this dish looks. I can't wait to dig in and I can't wait for you at home to try my recipe. Now that's Italian! For this recipe and more, visit youhadmeakitchen.com. Like, share, and enjoy.